Happy birthday, Minecraft. That's right, Minecraft today is 10 years old. You'll be going to school soon. Now, this is the celebrating 10 years, the 10 year anniversary website for Minecraft. Some of you would have seen this in a previous video where we checked out the oldest version of Minecraft ever. And there were two mystery boxes on that site. Well, now, now they've been filled in. Everything has been revealed and we were pretty much right in our prediction. So if I scroll all the way down here, here it is, here where the boxes were, and we've got some augmented reality, what has been renamed as awesome reality. <laughs> Minecraft Earth, which is a little bit confusing because Minecon, which is below, used to be called Minecon Earth, but you're gonna have to get your head around it. Minecraft Earth is a new augmented reality game that brings the Minecraft universe into our universe like never before. Experience Minecraft in a whole new way. So this is basically the Minecraft Minecraft Go that everyone thought was going to come out from the previous teaser. So without further ado, let's watch this thing. I've managed to avoid spoilers, so I have no idea what's going on. Let's play. Here we go. Minecraft Earth official reveal trailer. Let's watch this. This looks pretty real world to me. Fun. Have fun, he says. Oh, we will. Pop. Uh. <laughs> Dramatization. <laughs> I love that they have to put that in there. No, your phone cannot put Minecraft blocks in the real world. This is just augmented reality. Just in case you thought it would actually happen. So she's literally put a tree house in this old lady's front garden. She ain't gonna be happy. What's she gonna do next? This little Minecraft rebel. Do not attempt? What? They have to tell people not to skateboard? Okay, I'm getting distracted. She's putting trees in here. She's improving her neighborhood. I like it. Mushrooms. What else is she gonna do? Chickens. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Yeah, this could be cool. Whoa. <laughs> Just throw water on him. You're good. We got llamas in the house. Or in the street, even. Diamonds, mines, TNT. Be careful where you explode these things, guys. Nice. They built like a whole castle. So, what do you think? Not bad. <laughs> not bad is good. Not bad. It's is not good. bad. So she built a tower on top. Minecraft your world. Minecraft Earth. I wonder why they chose that title. Learn more at minecraft.net slash earth. Okay, let's do that. But first, this trailer doesn't really show much, does it? It just kind of shows the, uh, just Minecraft blocks and mobs and stuff inside the real world through a phone. So I'm guessing you can build stuff and put other things in the real world. But let's find out. Let's not speculate. Let's find out from the horse's mouth. There it is. Look at this. This looks way better. Look at the background. This guy is taking out a, um, a skeleton. Spider's climbing the stairs. He's got too many legs to do it. And they're kind of... It looks like they're collectively building. Oh, is this the interface? That looks kind of cool. Create. Minecraft has always been a game about creativity, but Minecraft Earth gives you the chance to express yourself on a whole new scale. Share your masterpieces and delve into others' creations. So we saw this in the trailer as well. Collect. Minecraft Earth features many of the mobs you know and love, along with a bunch of new ones. Oh, so they're having new ones just for this game? Interesting. Over time, you'll get the chance to breed unique variants and use them to populate your builds. So that's kind of like, if you if I compare that to Pokemon, you can breed Pokemon. And I guess if you breed like a, like a blue chicken and a red chicken, it makes a different color one. So that's a cool little idea. And then you can show off the rare ones that you've got in your own builds. Collaborate. Meet up with like-minded crafters. Did I say that right? Like-minded crafters and create masterpieces together. Work on a smaller scale with friends before taking your builds out into the world at full size. You can even team up with others for mini adventures. That sounds kind of cool too. Something that Pokemon Go doesn't do because let's compare the two. They're, they're in the same field. I guess Pokemon Go, you can't directly uh, help each other out. You can trade, I guess, but actually being able to build stuff together is really cool. Explore your real life neighborhood takes on a whole new dimension thanks to Minecraft Earth. Gather resources, take on challenges, and share your imagination with others. There's a whole new world to discover. So you can gather resources, there's challenges, and then sharing your imagination is obviously the building element. 
Oh, man. Um, okay. Okay, there's not a whole lot of information to go on here, is there? FAQ. Oh, wait, wait, here we go. Minecraft Earth will be free. Sweet. It will be on iOS and Android this summer on AR-compatible devices. So you have to have AR for this to work. I guess with Pokemon Go, you don't. You can sign up for the beta as well, so go ahead and do that if you want an early look at it. When will I get the Minecraft Earth skin for signing up for the beta? You will receive an email with instructions on how to claim your free skin. No one said anything about free skin. Hold up. Oh, there it is. Hey, that's kind of cool, actually. You get it in uh, Minecraft Earth, so you do have skins in Minecraft Earth as well. And Minecraft Bedrock. Look at this guy. I, I like that. That's cool. When will it be released? I've closed beta this summer. Player safety. Um, players and parents will be able to use the account management system. That's cool. Will Minecraft Earth have loot boxes? Nah, no, I don't think many people are going to do loot boxes anymore. <laughs> so there's a new skin for people that um, play on the Windows 10 edition. What's it called? Bedrock. But apart from that, this looks it could, like it could be quite cool. Is there any more info? I want more juicy details. Oh, maybe we could watch this. Yeah, let's watch this instead and see if there's any Minecraft um, Earth stuff in this. I really want to feel the intensity. It's okay. a big deal. Minecon's back. Bigger than ever, and it's going to be streamed live to the world, right? All right. You know what you're doing. Okay. Okay. I, I, yeah, I know what I'm doing, buddy. And we got the same accent. We sound like we're from the same place. We, we got this. It's Minecon live. Now, show me that excitement. <laughs> Big star coming in. Zero eye contact. <laughs> oh, right, end so man. you just relax and look into the camera, and we will get started. That's cool. Not again. Sick! <laughs> the foxes. You're supposed to tell us about the content. <laughs> okay, here we go. Can we get the uh, villager and the zombie Oh, yeah. Villager? Always count on a villager. Yeah, yeah. See, yeah. I worked with a villager for many, many years. To your mark here. Not okay. turtles, though. Okay. Bit slow. So, when I asked for the cutest mob, they sent me you. Wow. Some lettuce here for you, if you can just be as quick as you possibly can. <laughs> Oh no. Right, can we get a fresh villager? I need a, a non zombified villager. Please. <laughs> That's it. I quit. I quit. Just put all the info on a title card. Okay, there really wasn't that much info in there. <laughs> I think it's pretty much the same as last year. Okay, bleh. I'm looking forward to this. Minecraft Earth could be pretty cool. So, um, that's what we can really go on. There's not much more information. Looks like we can build. I want to look at this a little bit more. Because they're tapping blocks in kind of like an isometric style. Not what we're used to in Minecraft. So, it looks like you might build with your finger. There's a chest icon as well, which looks like it might be where your inventory is. You do have an inventory at the bottom. There's a flint and steel, so be careful with that. If you light that whole thing up, your friends are going to be upset. We've got words, and then the rest is covered by this guy's hand. So let me, let me just guess. So my guess is that you're going to find something like chests around the world, which have, in a similar way to Pokemon Go, like Pokestops. It must be built off the same thing, right? Or at least a similar thing, anyway. So you can find resources, and then you collect those resources, and you're able to build stuff kind of at the poker stops, if that makes sense. So you're finding resources, building stuff. It looks like they've got some pets in there as well. They've got a chicken, a pig in a mine cart, a pig going down in a mine cart, wolves, villagers, endermens, and cows. I think there's a spider down there too. Looks like they've got all the updated blocks as well, which is kind of nice. And then maybe, oh, you know what? If you could actually find dungeons like this, yeah, look, there's the stops in the background. I've just noticed. These look like they could be stops. And then if you mine them, they become this. And then you find chests. But you also have to fight bad guys. I figured it out. I figured it out. I figured it out. Piles of stone. You mine them away. It would be cool if you could like upgrade your tools to do it faster. Or you get more stuff underneath. And then you find the chest to get the resources and then build stuff. Seems pretty cool to me. And we can't really complain. It's going to be free. I'm just trying to see if there's any other... There's not really any other leaks in here. It says place, but that's pretty much it. It doesn't really show anything else. So I wonder if you could place things anywhere. I'm not sure. Actually, I guess a Pokestop wouldn't be on a table, so I guess you could. Maybe the Pokemon Go element is you go and find the resources, the chests and stuff like that. If you could find strongholds and stuff, that would be pretty cool too. And then you could just build and put things 
anywhere. Which would be crazy, because if you could see other people's builds, you could almost build another Earth on Earth. That sounds pretty cool to me. Anyway, that's pretty much it, I think. We've got Minecon, we've got uh, Minecraft Earth, and I'm pretty sure that's everything that they released on the new website. So, um, oh, wait, wait, wait. You can get 50% off the base game too. 10% off the top items in the Minecraft marketplace. So you can get Minecraft for half the price now. And I think it just became the most selling game in the world. It just overtook Tetris today. What a fitting day to do it. Congratulations, Minecraft. Well done, everyone. I'm excited for Minecraft Earth. What do you think? Do you think it's going to be cool? Do you think it's going to be lame? What are your ideas? Put them in the comment section down below. If you're excited for the game, then leave a like. That would be greatly appreciated. I'm going to try and get access to this puppy so that I can um, show you guys some footage of it. Play it as early as possible so I can show you. I'm excited for it. I think it's going to be cool. Apart from that, guys, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. That would be greatly appreciated. Subscribe if you are brand new as well. And if you're from the UK, I'm going on tour very, very soon. And tickets are running out. So if you want to come and see me live, hang out, have some fun, play some games, then click the link in the description below. That'd be greatly appreciated. Apart from that, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye! Posters, tie swing, wagon, candle, canvas, sofa, fork, rubber band.